What is going on, everybody? We're back on at One Piece episode 252. Last episode, we finally had Sanji show up. <laughs> it looks like the little uh, minute cold opening they had, they shot kind of showed him poking and plotting. We'll see. Uh, it's actually wild to me, like, how deep the government rolled up to uh, escort CP9 and the capture of Frankie and Robin's there as well. Like, it was actually really, really wild because I thought maybe those two workers that were kind of gossiping about it last episode about how they were going to try to see the faces of who they are and all that kind of stuff. <clears throat> and the government rolled up there real deep. The whole area marked off. Uh, I'm going to assume that nobody leaves the island. Um, because I don't see how Luffy and the others would be able to track them down once they get on the, the little Tom Tom. So I think the battle's going to go down right here, and this is going to. <clears throat> the bounties are going to go so high. I mean, this is direct government like involvement that we would get in right here. Uh, so we'll see. We got a little of uh, Nico Robbins' resolve and the, the decision she made and um, the confessions of, you know, her really caring for the group and as a friend's family, however you want to categorize it. Uh, so everybody's right here except Zoro, Luffy, Nami, and Chopper. Nami and Chopper are together. Zoro and Luffy are separate, but Yusup, Sanji, Nico, Frankie are all right here. Um, so hopefully, what I'm hoping by the end of this episode is at least Zoro or Luffy or both or or all. I hope within the next couple episodes everybody makes it to this point because I'm guessing it's going to go down right here. <clears throat> we'll see how it goes. Pressing play right now. And I think this right here, this involvement here with all the Marines and the government, I think this will finally get, um, this will finally get Sanji and Nami and Yusup's name on the, uh, on the bounty posters. I think so. I think it'll finally get them on search warrants and shit. <sighs> I'm, I still want to know how we're going to get through their abilities. <clears throat> Sanji knows nothing about any of this, by the way, or their, their abilities and what they do. So what was his plan here? Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Well, hopefully Iceberg can make people's hatred for us go away. But we got shit to do. <laughs> he turned into a raccoon dog. Iceberg, you're gonna let everybody know that we're not evil, right? You're gonna let them know. How much time do we have? How much time do they have till 11? Once they get, once everybody gets on that train, it's over. Mm -hmm. They get on that train and that train departs, it's GG. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh lord. Nah, not with all the government that's there. He wouldn't be able to override that. Yeah. Everything's been taken over by the government, he doesn't have that kind of say anymore. 
Chopper, why'd you power back down again? Bali's awake. They need all the help they can get. He doesn't, they don't know. Will you tell them already so we can get everyone to stop hating us? <clears throat> oh, wow. See how he said he doesn't know the true identity of the masked men? He could have easily ratted out the rest of the galley company and all that shit, but he chose not to. Dang, he wants the image of them to be held to a certain standard. He's not going to throw them under the bus. Shameless girl. Alright, so Polly's gonna take her and. And everybody else is gonna come with, uh. Everyone else is gonna come with, uh, Chopper and. Go track those down. Yeah, he doesn't want to tarnish the name of everything, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's easier that way. Hopefully they never do come back. It's kind of, if this was a deeper story, and, you know, we had connections with these characters, it'd be kind of screwed to just say they're gone, and people that really cared for Lucci and, you know, some of the others... Well, look at him holding Zoro's sword. But if, if Luchi and them had d deep connections to people around town, you'd think you'd want to give those people that explanation. But the story of One Piece isn't that deep yet, to where like you can just say, you know, they left when they're evil or something like that. Alright, look at Chopper being useful. Usopsa could never. I do like how much detail they give Nami's cutscene there with the tangerines and the and the pinwheel and the, the protractor and everything she's got going in the map. The voice actor for Chopper really deserves a raise. They stay having that voice actor just belt top of their lungs. <laughs> they really had that other guy whisper that. Good lord. They're really like Avengers Assemble out here. I better hurry up. Look, like this is like Alabasta all over again. We gotta get up there before that bomb blows up. Bro, that Yagara is burning as fast as it could go. I want to see that, uh, remember that act Nico was talking about? Um, basically, if the government deems it so, they can literally line up your location and just nuke your ass. <laughs> I want to see that go into effect, just to, like, I don't want to hear about it, I want to see it. That would be wild. Sanji, did you have a plan?
because he's still yet to do anything other than track them down, but we're heading there too, so Sanji, what have you done? We got our asses beat, and we're still going to get there and act at the same time you are. Do, can you, like, sabotage the train, or what? What they re but what really needs to happen is you need to somehow let that train leave, but get Nico off of it and do that accordingly. Because I don't think what we want—I don't think we want to have to throw hands with all those government officials and all those Marines. So wasn't Zoro doing his Spider-Man shit? Bounding rooftop to rooftop? Where the hell is he? Luffy was sandwiched between two buildings. You know they always gotta put him off to the side for a little bit. Did he lace the, the train with explosives? What are we doing here, buddy? He's over here going through half a pack of cigs. Killing his lungs. I need him to get to it. Luffy, are you even trying to get out of there? Could he not sling his arm out of there? And grab something? Oh my god. Both of them. Well, Sanji, guess it really is up to you. Hopefully, they can at least maybe see Zoro dangling somewhere. They need to get on some high ground. Mm. They're really dr making this dramatic here. That train should have been pulled out. Especially if it was on government time. They're going early. Well, I'm going to assume Sanji's done something to um, hinder this departure. Like I know he uh, he looks like he's just walking up to it, but I'm I'm hoping he he's actually done something here. They're going 10, 15 minutes early. Yeah, they don't gotta wait for shit. They can pull whenever they want. Bro, wha what are you directing? There's nothing to direct. There's nobody. <laughs> Just let the train pull out. There's still so much deep to her character that we haven't gotten. She's like the only character that has any kind of thing about her that I'm still waiting to see. There's still a lot of like nuances to some characters that I want to see flashbacks of, Zoro and Sanji especially. Um, but 
her character, like, I feel like we've only gotten, like, 5% of it. They give us, like, pieces and pieces here, but she hasn't had, like, a dedicated just episodes to backstory like all the others have. Raftel? I need to know their connection, those two. Okaji and uh, Robin? Is it just because she's wanted that he knows who she is and it scares her? Or like, is there actual history between them? I remember when I first saw him, I thought, he was, I thought they were brother and sister. Which, look-wise, isn't far off, I don't think. Sanji, tell me you placed explosives or paper bombs or something on the track. Frankie, aren't you a cyborg? Can't you, like, flex and bust up out of that bitch? Sanji's over here going through another half a pack of cigs like he's got something planned, so he doesn't seem to be in a rush either. Is he just gonna get on? Is he really just gonna get on? There's no plan? What was he doing? We know the train's not going to leave. Zora will straight up die, though, down there. No bullshit. Train's gone, Nami. Is the back wheel going to blow off or something? Episode cut. Be wild as hell if uh, Sanji just sat down and took a seat right next to her. That shit really did pull off. All right. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see because it's going to be. They could go. I mean, One Piece doesn't. It hasn't struck me as a type of story that would do that. To where to where characters are going to separate that big. Because um, usually it's the same recipe for every arc. New location, group gets scattered, group slowly starts piecing their way back together until the group finally gets back together to defeat whatever it is they need to defeat. Same thing here. Um, but would we... Are they going to stretch that to, like, fully separating? Like, having Nico and Sanji go off to this government, you know, island? While the rest of us have to wait for the for days for that hurricane, monsoon swell to calm down and then attempt to break in? I don't think, no, I don't think One Piece is going to do all that. Not yet, at least. There could be arcs here where we're not even, where characters aren't even on the same island. Um... I don't think we're going to do that, to have to go like bust them up out of that government, because I don't even think that would be possible for our current skill level. I'm curious how the hell we get that train back <laughs> here, because I just don't think that's where the story is going to go, but leave it there and see. Appreciate it, everybody. Like, share, favorite, subscribe, as always. 